Baby Bird Learns to Fly Once upon a time, a group of little birds were learning how to fly. While all other little birds joyfully jumped off the tree and began flying, one baby bird was afraid of falling down and breaking its neck. Well, you won't fall, the teacher bird said. You know how to fly. When the baby bird refused to budge, the teacher gave it a gentle push. At first, the baby bird was shocked. But soon, it spread its wings and began to fly. Moral of the story is don't let fear cloud your instinct. Please like share subscribe and click the bell icon. Dreams A grandmother sat by the fireplace telling all her grandchildren bedtime stories. She told them great tales of kings, queens, and fairies. The children wanted to enter a dream world as they heard these fantastic stories. Granny, we are not able to enter this exciting dream world. Please help us, the children complained. Once you close your eyes, the dream world will come to you. You won't have to go to it. Good night, the grandmother said. The children closed their eyes and sure enough, found themselves transported to magical lands. Moral of the story is do not chase wonder, let it come to you. Please like share subscribe and click the bell icon. John's Bicycle John was a very poor boy. He earned money by selling newspapers every morning. One day, John thought that if he owned a bicycle, he could go everywhere to sell newspapers. But John did not have the much money to buy a bicycle. John did not lose heart. He started saving a penny every day. Within a year, he had enough money to buy a shiny, new bicycle. With the help of the bicycle, John sold many newspapers and became rich. Moral of the story is saving little money at a time can help you gather a lot of wealth. Please like share subscribe and click the bell icon. John's Laughter There was once a boy named John. He laughed at everyone's problems. If a friend fell, John would laugh. His mother unexpectedly fell down, while carrying a cake in her hand. John never helped anyone. He paid no attention to his mother's advice on being compassionate. One day, John was going to school. It was monsoon and the road was filled with muddy puddles. Suddenly, a car sped by and splashed Joe's uniform with mud. All his friends started laughing. They laughed and laughed. But no one came forward to help him. Moral of the story is what goes around comes around. Please like share subscribe and click the bell icon. The Blind Man's Lamp A blind man moved around with a lamp at night. Everyone wondered how the lamp helped this blind man. But no one asked him. One day, a curious boy asked the blind man, why do you carry a lamp around? You can't even see. I don't carry the lamp for myself, boy, the blind man replied. I carry it so that people like you, who can see, 
don't bump into a blind man like me. Moral of the story is there is always a reason behind every action. Please like share subscribe and click the bell icon. The Lonely Flower and the Bee There once stood a very lonely flower in the corner of a garden. It had no other flower to talk to. One day, a bee decided to pay the flower a visit. Don't worry, said the bee. You will soon get a friend. The bee said goodbye to the flower and took some of its pollen. It spread the pollen around the flower. Within weeks, a handful of new flowers sprang up. The flower in the corner of the garden was not lonely anymore. Moral of the story is an act of kindness can change someone's life. Please like share subscribe and click the bell icon. The Palace and the Hut A king decided to build a beautiful palace on top of a mountain. When the construction of the palace was complete, the king went to inspect it. He saw an ugly hut near the palace. What is this hut doing near my palace? Your majesty, an old lady lives there. She says this hut is very dear to her. We tried offering her money, but she would not let us demolish the hut. Let it be there. It will remind me that there are certain things money cannot buy. Moral of the story is everything cannot be bought by money. Please like share subscribe and click the bell icon. The Cock and the Jewel A cock was strolling through a garden in search of a grain of wheat for food. It combed through the grass and looked carefully under the shrubs, but couldn't find that grain of wheat. Instead, the cock found a glistening jewel. It was a blue shiny stone, which could be worth millions. Oh, but what use is it to me, the cock thought. It won't satisfy my hunger. It's only the grain of wheat that's precious to me. Moral of the story is different people value different things. Please like share subscribe and click the bell icon.